When I was 17, we threw a party and a homeless guy shit in our floor. Dude, nice. that is a fucking good story. Continue. Well, um, my boys went to the gas station and um, they found a homeless guy out there and he bought him alcohol. And it was real fucking cold that night. And I live in eastern Tennessee. And um, they were like, yeah, man, come on, like, come back to this party. We're having it over here. And they brought him back with them, and he was, like, really cool. And actually, I got along with the guy the whole night. He was actually my beer pong partner. Um, nice. We ran the table for about ten games. We played Edward Forty hands together. Um, honestly, he was a really cool guy. And he asked us where the bathroom was, and he got up, and he went in there. And he was gone for, like, 30, 45 fucking minutes, man. And uh, finally, the owner of the house... Um, well, sorry, I started to skip ahead. The guy finally leaves. He, but he like kicks the fucking door open and leaves. But we're so hammered at this point, we're not really paying that much attention. Then finally, the owner goes into the bathroom, and about the second he shuts the door, he flings it right back open. And he's like, "Who the fuck shit all over my floor?" And we go in there, and I swear to God, it's like the scene from Daddy Daycare, man. There's, like, shit all over the floor. Like, it's not, like, really high up the wall, but, like, it's on the wall, probably, like, waist high. And, like, a turd in the toilet clogging it about, like, a like fist size. And what I honestly kind of think happened was, like... He was so drunk while he was shitting, like, he passed out, and whenever he finally passed that fucking megalodon of a turd out of his asshole, he just fucking, like, fell on the floor and just shit everywhere. And he just left. <laughs>